This 3 News Now update sponsored by Godfather's Pizza. Order today. I'm Courtney Johns with 3 News Now. Here's a look at what's happening now. Rising water levels could force you to change your travel plans as soon as tonight. The Iowa Department of Transportation says it expects to close I-29 north of Council Bluffs. That will be the third closure of this year for those living in the Honey Creek area. IDOT officials say it will not affect this morning's drive, but the interstate could be shut down later today. And just downstream, many in Mills County are preparing for similar problems. That's the county just east of Sarpy County, across the Missouri River. While the rising water is not expected to affect homes, the rising river could put two recently repaired levees to the test. And on 3 News Now, meteorologist just Mark Stitt. It's going to be a warm and muggy afternoon. Temperature is topping out near 89 degrees with lighter winds compared to yesterday. Now this evening, a few more thunderstorms will start to fire off. Those become much more widespread overnight and heading into Thursday morning with lows near 70. But not everyone's going to see that rain heading into Thursday morning. Tomorrow afternoon, we should be dry. Plenty of cloud cover out there. Should once again keep us under 90 degrees. So we'll top out near 87. Friday, warm and breezy. Temperatures in the mid 80s. And the cold front comes through on Saturday, bringing a few showers and thunderstorms with it, but that's going to keep us in the low 80s Saturday afternoon, Sunday down into the upper 70s. And with that lower humidity in place, the first day of fall on Monday could start in the upper 50s and only the low 80s early next week. Want something spicy? Sliced jalapeno peppers, cream cheese, beef, bacon, and real cheddar and mozzarella cheese. It's my jalapeno papa pie. Add a one-topping pizza and cinnamon monkey bread for a real feast. Godfather's Pizza. Do it!